anyone who finds these bizarre egg sacs in their backyard should really try not to panic you might not think about it but whenever you eat a mushroom you're consuming one of the most diverse and magical life forms on the planet the members of the fungi kingdom which includes mushrooms yeasts and molds come in a startling array of forms but none can hold a candle to the utterly bizarre clathrus archeri also known as the devil's fingers these naturally occurring oddities might be perfectly normal in reality but that doesn't stop them from appearing completely and totally alien native to New Zealand and Australia clathrus archeri are more commonly known as devil's fingers it's actually a phalloid fungus and it looks positively out of this world seriously how strange is this but unlike most of its fungi brethren devil's fingers doesn't sprout straight from the earth no this stuff is way way too cool for that sort of thing instead it begins life in a kind of egg sack of all things it looks almost like an alien creature as it matures the sack is breached by a number of terrifying red tentacles at first glance it looks like some kind of demon is reaching up from the underworld this is pretty bizarre right but they're actually totally harmless the forearms are coated in a sticky strong smelling tissue meant to attract flies however the fungus is not carnivorous which seems lucky for us and the flies instead it contaminates the flies with its spores turning them into agents of dispersal few things on earth are as strange as this bizarre time-lapse video that showcases the hatching process as the footage moves along we get more glimpses of the horrifyingly real emergence of the devil's fingers it really does start to resemble something out of a science fiction movie yuck get a load of this thing someone needs to call up Ridley Scott and tell him that he should consider incorporating this into the new alien film sometimes nature is beyond our wildest dreams or nightmares but that's not the only creepy looking fungus out there other members of the clathrus genus are just as fascinating there's the clathrus ruber which expands into this amazing latticework structure how crazy are these things another cousin called the pseudocollus fusiformis looks like the progeny of some horrifying squid monster they resemble the devil's fingers a little bit but the coloring is obviously different as amazing as these are you might be even more stunned to learn that devil's fingers are actually considered a delicacy in some areas we think we'll just appreciate them from afar thank you very much share these creepy organisms with your friends below